we explore posture-aware pen and touch interactions for tablets. Our techniques transition between nuances of mobile versus stationary use. Our system supports posture awareness by combining three sensing modalities, including the raw capacitance image from the touchscreen, the tilt sensing capability built into the tablet itself, and a custom electric field sensor around the bezel to sense grip, as well as proximity of the hand and forearm. When you grasp the tablet, grip-centric thumb tools appear. If the grip changes, the thumb tools follow. Sometimes, it's unclear where to best put the tools. Just tilt to tip them one way or the other. A thumbable radial menu expands the commands available, and the tools fade away when the thumb withdraws. Putting the tablet down flat returns the tools to a more standard device-centric palette. When you settle down to write or sketch, hand-centric palm tools appear. These miniature tools are easy to reach with the pen and let you stay focused on the work at hand. The palm tools also orient to match the angle of the palm. And the radial menu rotates too. North is always true north relative to the hand. Tipping your hand back fades the tools to a dim outline so it's easy to check your work without losing your sweet spot, while the tools stay in a stable location. The fan tools appear when you hold two fingers. So on the desktop, you can work with both hands. When you let go, the fan tools disappear. But when you work with one hand, the fan tools stay posted. Posture awareness lets us gracefully degrade the interaction to suit mobile use. A French curve serves as a tangible prop. The tools snap right to it and fully materialize when you touch the prop. But where they appear depends on which hand you use. As sensed by electric field. Even the pen can act as a tangible prop. Placing it on the screen reveals all of its hidden properties. And options for the pen tip. The pen button. And the eraser. You can even use the pen as a container for photos, or whole applications. Posture awareness can also combine grip and screen orientation, so tablet orientation does the right thing. Or suggest apps suitable to the current tablet posture as speculative shortcuts you can easily grab when picking up the device. Overall, we have seen how posture awareness can adapt interaction and morph user interface elements to suit the fine-grained context of use. This includes grip, the angle of the tablet, which hand the user employs, and other nuances of touch, including tangible props, but in a tablet-savvy way suitable for mobile use. Taken together, these contributions show how a few simple sensors can enable tablets to more effectively support both mobile and stationary use, and the many gradations in between.